Hello and welcome. Please read this problem, pause the video, and try it on your own. Here we're finding the value of two variables, x and y, in this equation. I notice that x here is a base, right? So x is the base. And I, I, I usually actually do write things like this down because I like to take my time and establish what's going on. y is an exponent. And I also notice that we have a fraction on the, on the left-hand side. And then we get these big numbers, 55 to the third over 11 to the third. So we're dividing, right? This fraction means division. I notice that 11 goes into 55 five times. That might be useful. I also notice that the exponents here are both 3 and 3. So there is a law of exponents that applies directly here. We'll get back to that in a second. But let's just play with these numbers to make sense of what's happening. By play, I mean kind of expand and manipulate and move things around. So expanding first. 55 to the third is 355 is being multiplied, and 11 to the third is 11 uh, being multiplied three times. Then I recognize that, well, well, we're dividing here these two products, so we can pair them up, right? 55 over 11 three times. And that means we can think of this as 55 divided by 11, which is 5, times another 5, and times, finally, a, a third 5. And that's just 5 to the third. So here, we discover that x is 5, right, and y is 3. And the law of exponents here that we're kind of bringing out is that if the exponents are the same and we're dividing or multiplying, you can just straight divide or multiply those bases. We can say 55 divided by 11 is 5, and we keep those exponents the same, right, keep the third in there. So if you're multiplying or dividing with the same exponents, you can just multiply or divide the bases. All right, hope this helped.